Hello, I'm Anmol Karan. And I'm Chaitanya Sonare. And our project is the book Four Second. All right, let's get to the Q&A. Okay, the first question. What made us choose this topic? Well, we chose this topic because of the different ways you could play around with it. We were able to make the story pretty interesting due to our selection. Also, it is based upon the current state of the world. It is taken to a higher level. Yes, well put. Okay, next question. What problems did we face while writing this book? Well, as this was our first time writing a book, we didn't have much of an idea how to go on with things in the beginning. But as we went on with the story, it became clear to us how we wanted to proceed, which is why you might notice that the latter chapters are way better than the first few ones. Also, one of our group members left our group at the start of the year, which even though he hadn't contributed much to the story, was a demoralizer. Although, if you look at it, it also helped us in a way. As after he left, we came to our senses and realized how much we were slacking off and that we needed to pick ourselves up. But I agree with you more. Okay, the last question. What is our favorite passage from the book? Well, this is a sensitive matter, but I think we do agree on one specific part, which is the flashback. I will read it out now. Four years ago. You gotta go, Will. We've already lost mom and dad. We can't lose each other. I and Will ran besides each other, away from our home, away from our parents, who had fallen prey to the infestation. Where are we gonna go, Beth? There's a refugee camp a few miles from here. We need to get there. It's our only hope at survival. I'm scared, Beth. I don't want to become like mom and dad. I'm scared too, Will. Just stay close to me. We'll be all right. I love you. I love you too. A man comes into view, running towards us at full speed. Will lets out a scream. He's scared, and so am I. That's one of them. Beth, I don't want to die. We won't die. Come on, let's go. We turn left into an alleyway. It is a dead end. Oh no! Come on, we might be able to climb the wall. And we'll run towards the towards the end. The man in hot pursuit. I try pushing Will over the wall, but he is too heavy. The man is here now, foaming at his mouth. He slowly t- comes towards us, growling. Will breaks into tears. Will? Yeah. I'm sorry. What do you mean? I'm. I'm so so sorry. What do you? He's cut short as I push him towards the man. He screams, and the man leaps onto him. I clamber over the wall and disappear into the city. I'm sorry, Will. A scream and the sound of a gunshot goes through the air, but I turn away. Ah, perfect. Makes me want to read the book again. All right, that was the end of the Q and A. Thank you, Shilpa Thai, for giving us this opportunity to express ourselves. We are forever thankful. 